You know, for the people that aren't believers, that don't believe uh, the end times, or don't believe in the Bible, don't believe in Jesus Christ, like I've always said, it's their right. But we are clearly seeing the signs continue to grow, continue to speed up. You're looking at what's happening with China. You're looking with North Korea. The wars and rumors of wars, the tensions that are rising just on the wars alone. I'm not talking about anything else. Now, like I said, there are scoffers. There are people that say that, uh, you know, this is all nonsense. It's all baloney. There's always been things in the world. There's always been uh, economic collapse or disease or famine or whatever. Yes, but not, and like I said, a million times, not at the rate that we're going now. And remember, the next world war that, that happens is going to be nuclear. It's going to be chemical. It's not just going to be, uh, you know, boots on the ground, so to speak. It's not going to be um, just a conventional war that we used to have in, like, World War One, World War Two, Vietnam, whatever war you want to talk about. The next war that we have will be nuclear, and it will be devastating. The Bible says a third of the population will be destroyed. You're watching the tensions heat up with China. You're watching the... Uh, you know, North Korea, you know, the Russia-Ukraine things been going on for a year. You've seen Iran, Israel, Syria, they're all, that's ready, that's ready to, to explode, I believe. They've been fighting every day in Syria, uh, with, with Damascus, I should say. So, you've seen the Pope with everything that comes out of his mouth, and the one world religion, one world money, the one world government, the new world order. It's happening. You know, they want to take money away. They, they, I read something with uh, some of the European countries want to take money away. They want to make it almost illegal, if I read it correctly. They want to make it uh, illegal to have money. They want to monitor everything. They want to know everything you do, every transaction you make. Well, we're there already now with banks and PayPal and everything else. They're monitoring everything we do. They want everything. You're seeing what's going on with uh, the former president. And that nonsense and that craziness and, you know, God has a plan, God has a purpose, and God's will will be done. Just like when Jesus prayed to him the night before. Let, let not my will be done, but let your will be done. God has a plan, and it's all coming together as far as the end times, as far as the days we are living in now. If you don't believe, that's fine. But you need to look around at what's happening, and you need to read your Bible. Because the end times are here. We don't know the time, only the Lord does. May God bless you all.